Hi there, folks. You know, we got a celebrity in the house today for Cook's Corner. We're joined by Luca Paris from Luca's Mediterranean Cafe and the market at Luca's out of yep. Keene. Thank you for being here. First it's great all. to be here, man. Uh, I love it. It's, it. This is my yearly visit in October, so I'm enjoying really it. I haven't had a chance to talk to you, but you won Chef of the Year. Uh, New Hampshire Lodging and Restaurant Association picked me for the Chef of the Year. So How did you win that? I, I don't know. They just told me. They just, they just told me <laughs> I, I was a chef. I didn't have exasperation. I, I, you know, I, I, I said the same <laughs> thing. Why me? Why but it worked out well. Um, it was a great honor and and our restaurant won business of the year for for Keen as well and I, nice. I was just on Food Network in the last year so a lot of cool things are happening and we're having a lot of fun and but more importantly yeah. This next weekend, Saturday the 18th, it's October 18th, okay. Pumpkin Fest comes Pumpkin to Keene yep. again. Last year we broke the world record. We got it back from Boston. Yeah, I know, it wasn't and this year it's, it's going to be all about the people. So okay. it's, we're going to have a lot of fun, great time to bring your family down, have a great time. It's incredible. There's so much going on there. Yeah. Plus good food. So Plus good are, food. And what that's what's one yeah. of the things we're making today. Okay. So one of the things I put on the menu, we, we also, uh, Pumpkin Festival as a festival, won an award as well, was the best USA Today named Pumpkin Festival, the best food festival in the country. I knew that. We had that on Daybreak. So okay. how cool is that? Very and cool. one of the reasons why is restaurants like mine and, and small um, nonprofit organizations doing everything that has pumpkin to it. Yep. So these are pumpkin and butternut squash ravioli. I have cool. garlic, um, shallots. We have some prosciutto and sage in here. I'm going to need that hard apple cider, man. Okay, do you want me to pour that in? No, I'll pour it in. Oh, you, you never know. Trust me, you know, well, well, I'm not chef with you. Oh, well, I see. You don't want to explode You know what's face. happened here. And this is a brand new set. I don't want to lose <laughs> okay, this. Okay, fair enough. All right, so we got the hard apple cider in there, the prosciutto, okay. and the sage. I'm going to put a little salt and pepper in there. And then the, this, what we have is sweet ravioli, right? Okay. So we need to give it a sauce that has kind of savoriness to it. The sage is savory, the prosciutto is savory. It's all these great flavors. And then we bring it together. Oh. And so as we reduce this down, we'll put a little bit of cream in there. I see kind of levels the okay. playing field. And then while it's cooking down, you start getting a real sauce out of it. So we'll turn it on high, let that cook down, and add the ravioli. But this Saturday, coming up, is Pumpkin Festival. This is 60 yeah, what is it like? Describe what it's like out there. We're talking about 60 or 70,000 people coming down. Last year, we had over, well, we had 30,581 jack-o'-lanterns lit. Lit jack-o'-lanterns. And you know what yep. the toughest part about lighting our jack-o'-lanterns is? Uh, lighting our jack o' lantern. I was going to say the wind? <laughs> guess, well, no, it's the toughest part is actually, and guess, actually going around and doing and it. And we have our new sponsor who is sponsoring Pumpkin Festival. One of the, our sponsors, our main sponsors, is Zippo Lighters. Uh, they're giving us that these comes cool, in handy. These, they're giving us these cool lighters. They're decorative and beautiful, and we get to light the pumpkins, and we'll go light them faster, and maybe we'll even break our own record oh, again. Oh, okay. So it's been a lot of fun, and uh, Pumpkin Festival, I've been in Keene for the last. 14 years, mm -hmm. and it's just been incredible to be part of this experience. There's so many people. It feels like Disneyland for a little bit. Oh, I've been out there and several times with the family. It's a lot of fun. Uh, There's so many different activities you can do as well. So oh, it's, an, up our it's a whole For folks day. who haven't been out there who don't know where you are, where are you located? So I'm, I'm located right on Central Square in Keene. It's right where you, you see the, the White Steeple Church if you okay. get down to Keene. Um, and as you get in there, uh, if, the, if you're coming down on Pumpkin Festival, do not try and drive into town. Stop yeah. at one of the outside yeah. centers and come down. Satellite lots will take but you But if you're, if you're coming any other time, it's absolutely beautiful town to drive right in. Right downtown, very pretty. So we're going to put a little bit of our sauce right on here. All right. You need to finish me off uh, here with the garnish. garnish. We're going to put a little baby kale on there. So we're breaking up this kind of sweet ravioli. The butternut squash and pumpkin ravioli with all, right. all these great flavors. And Pumpkin Festival, don't miss it. Come Excellent. down. Congratulations on being Chef of the Year, Thanks, too. Thanks, man. Paris. Thank it was you a great very time. much. That does it for us.